Wow, that's so cool. Uh, finally, I found the way to do a masking in Luma Fusion. I have seen so many videos. They have created a tutorial on a masking, but I don't like it very much because they are using green screen. But I found that uh, working with green screen uh, with the masking with their masking technique that is not so good. So I did a little bit of testing and error. I found out the new way to do a masking in Luma Fusion. Uh, no green screen, no blending mode, no black screen, nothing. A uh, real masking with the help of little secret was the video. And so you will understand how to do this masking in Luma Fusion. And this technique is very much powerful and it will unleash and it will unlock the way you do masking in Luma Fusion. So I hope you found this video useful. This is Sushant. I'm your Luma Fusion coach from Switch to Y. Let's learn how to do masking in Luma Fusion. First, we are going to open Luma Fusion like this, and we are going to create a new project. Before that, I will show you something. This is the project I have created in Luma Fusion. A real masking, no green screen. At the end of the video, I will show you what's inside this project file and I will open and I will showcase each and everything. So watch the video till end to know about more about this created project on an iPad. First, now we are going to create a new project type masking test. Frame rate will be 25. You can choose anything 30 frame, 60 frame, anything. But I have a 20 FPS file. Landscape mode color space will be 709. And create a new project. And we need a clip. Okay, this is the clip. And we are going to drag it like this. Now what we have to do, we have to take a best part like this, it's coming and going and make a cut and we are going to cut from the start. I think this will be one second 10 frame like this. Let's play. Okay. And we are going to export this first in the photos like this and we have to open procreate now what we have to do tour like this just bring this photos and drag our exported clip like this on procreate Here we have the project masking test. Open this and we are going to do some settings in the bottom. You will find a playhead like this. See? And over here you will find three options that is play, settings, add frame. First we are going to do the settings like this and in the setting, we are going to select one shot. The frame will be 25. Onion skin frame will be max. Onion skin opacity will be 0, 0 like this. And now on the right hand side corner, you will find the layer tool. Over here, you will find the layers. And we need to scroll from where we want to start the masking like this link from okay from the 24 from over here we are going to start the masking for that zoom like this okay and on the left hand side corner you are going to select selection tool like this and we are going to select freehand like this now we are going to do a masking means we are going to create the masking like this as we tap 
you will find this hatching what does the hatching means hatching means it will stay like this and the non hatching part will be cut out okay for that we are going to do a feather tool like this in the bottom and we are going to select some amount to do you have to play with it what this feather tool will do the job of a feather tool is to create the softness it will add a softness to the edges like this and tab on this setting tool tab on this add button and tab cut okay so here we have the smooth edges it will not feel like we have made a cutout that's why we have used feather tool okay now we are going to move ahead you can move ahead with the help of layer tool like this or you can use the playhead like this okay so we are going to do everything like this second option when second layer tab on the selection tool again we are going to do a masking like this tab outside and tab hit like this tab on feather arrange the feather like this thing fifth will be okay five five percent tab on cut like this move ahead like this we are going to repeat the procedure one pro tip when you do a masking means when you are going to use the selection tool always left some little space like i have left this see this okay now again use the feather tool 5% will be enough again cut it move ahead and this do it you can skip the procedure if you want to i have given the timestamp tab on setting clear to cut so we are having a transparency like this okay it's doing create a selection tool okay add a feather cut move ahead i'm doing a little faster cut this Add a feather again. Repeat the same procedure. Move ahead. is complete cut like this person 
there is no thumb rule that you will need a 5% or 4% it depend upon the scene you can play with it but one tip keep the consistency of uh, if you are using 4% keep 4% create a cut like this and again here I think we have the last part this create a cut then we have completed our masking and now let's play it okay wonderful let's play it slowly wow okay so i will delete this i think okay i will delete this clip you can delete like this we have created the masking with the hevc transparency now we are going to learn how to export this in luma fusion for that tab on the setting option and tab on share we are going to select animated hevc like this and here we are going to select 25 fps with the transparent background resolution will be max resolution and tab on export like this and select luma fusion okay and we are going to find where it is okay here we have masking and we are going to drag this and go back we are going to select another clip now like this Delete this. See now. Wonderful. Let me play it again. You don't need to do anything. See. The masking clip will be above the clip. Like this. See. And let me open it. So, undo it. See we have a transparent background like this you can create now let me show you how i created this see i have did some color grading over here to match the scene like this see it's transparent here Let me show you see it's transparent you can use lot plus little more correction over here see Here is a train clip. See, right. is it okay? So, like this, you can create wonderful masking 
it's very super easy to create just it will take a little time to make the selections and you will get the wonderful result i hope you found this video useful then give a big thumbs up share with your friends see you very soon in the new amazing video till then take care stay safe bye bye